to say this to those, those three lawmakers. You know, Trump is not a racist. He's a realist. And the only color he sees is green, and he wants you to have some of it. That's right. And what I don't understand about these lawmakers is why are they pushing this narrative? You know, there's an old saying, what you think you see in others is what's in you. That's right. Maybe they need to get the racism out of their own hearts towards this president so that we can move this country forward. That's right. I, I want black people to also look at these two lawmakers that's black. They ain't one piece of legislation that they pushed within the last year mm -hmm. to help ur uh, inner and urban cities, to help benefit black communities. None. We, our eyes are open. People need to wake up. These are the people that we need to vote out. And well, the sad thing is the same black people that's talking about racism this and racism that, mm -hmm. black people are racist towards their own race. Just look at the, the derogatory names that they call Diamond and Silk, Coons and Uncle Tom. And we have proof this is not a latch. You can go to Diamond and Silk Wall of Shame and see all of the derogatory and racist remarks that black people make against us to black women. So before you start calling, saying something about the white man being racist, check your own self. Take a look in the mirror and look at your own black race being racist towards each other. Well, if great you look point. at, uh, it's a great point. If you look at uh, black unemployment at an all-time low right now, it, would there ever come a point where members of the Congressional Black Caucus or other black leaders would recognize that and say, maybe something's working and we should do more of that? Well, see, they don't want to recognize it because right. they're part of the problem. These groups are part of the problem and keep black people suppressed. That's why I always say, say out loud, Listen, go past these groups. Take your message directly to the, the people. people and forget about these groups and organizations, organizations that's working for their own greed yes. and not the need of the people. Yes, that is some of the what best they're doing is segregating their self. They're segregating their self from the process of moving this country forward. And they're keeping people stuck in the pains of their ancestors. It's time for black people to wake up and let's press forward and stop staying stuck in the past. Well, that's right. some of the best communications advice that the White House could get. Skip the groups that purport to speak for minorities. Go right to the people. Great. Yeah, now, that's right.